I'm Jennifer Angel from Mysteries of Astrology. These are your stars for the coming week, Aquarius. Okay, so it seems like your business area and your home and family could have some conflict going on this week and they're certainly under the spotlight. So there is a full moon in your solar fourth house later this week on the 17th, so right at the end of the week. Now with the full moon energy it's always a time when it can be a little bit unsettled but it's a time where you can gain closure on things that are not working the way that you want them to work. So you can get either through you're doing or sometimes it can be through decisions that other people make which force you to make changes in one way or another the full moon helps you move on so uh, you know a little bit of disruption is, is a good thing sometimes it's almost like you know if everything sails along uh, with you know without a hitch then you can stagnate and of course for an Aquarian that's never an option now right there in your solar 10th house it still continues to be an abundance of activity. Um, we do still have Mercury there, ruler of uh, communication and commerce and Mercury has only just come out of its retrograde phase. Okay, One of my least favorite transits. When Mercury is a retrograde thing it's easy for mix ups can happen. I mean by nature Mercury can be a trickster um, but when it's retrograde, you can have miscommunications, arrangements can get mixed up uh, because it's a communication of also electronic um, equipment, then that can fail. You want to like make sure you save your work regularly. And uh, but it's just come out as I said on the 11th so during this week is still a, a little bit unstable for one of a better word uh, because we're in that area of the storm okay and that's what happens when you go when a mercury or a planet is going into a retrograde or out of a retrograde phase so any major decisions either tread carefully or try to you put them aside for another week or at least until midweek now Venus is sitting right there behind you which means it's in in Capricorn so it means it's heading closer towards you so if you're looking for love or you want to improve your, your love life your social life this is the time just to think about what it is you want it's like you have to do your Harvard business plan of love okay to attract the type of person and situation you want into your life okay have a great week Aquarius thanks for watching I'm Jennifer Angel broadcasting for New York City bye for now